Good evening. Good evening, everybody. <clears throat> uh, what time is it? It's nine nine thirty on a Wednesday evening. My house is nice and quiet, so best time for me to be able to um, do a Facebook live. Well, it's Wednesday night, so I thought I'd just wing one. I need to make a um, a masculine card, so I thought, why not? I'll just pop on quickly, wing it away, and um, have some fun. So I hope everybody's doing well and that you've had a good week so far. It's hump day, so we're nearly at the weekend. <clears throat> so I won't waffle on. I'll just put you down and we can get going. So what we'll need to, what we're using tonight, um, I'll give you the tools and product and the cardstock we'll be using. So <clears throat> because I want to make a quick and easy card, I normally use this pack, oops, upside down. It is the Assorted Memories and More Cards and Envelopes. So these come already scored and they come in that size. So you get 10 of each and you get them with the envelopes as well. So that's pretty easy already for you and you're good to go. So I like having these on hand because it makes it easy for me to just get going with the card. I don't have to cut anything so all you basically need to do is you score it I actually want to use an avocado I don't like this one um, you just score it you take the envelope out as well we score it I'll actually show you everything we're going to use tonight first so that's our white card stock it's a really good quality card stock to um to use we're going to use our bone folder to burnish that crease then we've also got some scrap whisper white and we've got some knight of navy not sure if i'm going to use it yet to be honest then <clears throat> this is what i want to play with tonight i just want to use this um this is retiring it's in our come sail away sweet and I'll just open it up for you so you can see in the current catalog we have this beautiful suite now it's still available as a retired item and you get all of this in one suite and this whole suite is still available um, <clears throat> we also so this is the stamp set here so and that's the beautiful papers that you can also still get which is still available I actually just wanted to see how much it's going for. Um, oh, I've just gone right out now. It's all right. So I'll get. I'll, if you need to know, just let me know, and I'll I'll tell you. But it's still available. The whole suite is still available. The um, and everything is while stocks last. So this is the. I'm going to be using um, the memories and more card pack which is this here so everything in here you can buy individually um, if it's still available or you can buy it all together and get everything so it has a stamp set it comes with framelits it's got a um, a embossing folder it has the designer series paper it has the um, memories and more card it's got the baker's twine and it's got these embellishments they're really cute and the stamp set has these beautiful um, sentiments. Let hope be your anchor through the storms of life. Very appropriate for the times we're going through at the moment. It's got like a compass. It's got congrats, um, thanks, a little anchor. Uh, set sail in the direction of your dreams. It's got these little birds. You are my true north. And the stamp with like a rope. Um stamp it's got a, a lighthouse and a little boat now these are all framelits in there as you can see over there so you'll be able to cut them all out it's a really neat little set and these cards in here if you have the annual um catalog the current one you'll see they've made some beautiful cards in here that you can case now the other stamp set um, I'm, I'm going to be using is this beautiful stamp set it's called a good man and this is actually carrying over into our new catalog so 
that's what I wanted to show you. That's what I'm work what we're working with tonight. So we're going to be using our memories and more cards. I'll take that out in a minute. And then these two stamp sets. So this is the stamp set that I was just showing you. And these are the framelits that all goes with it in that stamp set. So I like to keep my stamp set and my framelits together in one. Um, in I'm smacking my lips again. <laughs> I was just talking to my husband about that. I tend to smack my lips for some reason. So I've got, um, I always keep my, um, my stamp set and my framelits in one holder. And so I put it on a magnetic sheet on the back and then I keep them together. So, <clears throat> yeah, as you can tell, I'm a bit nervous again. Um, anyway. If you're commenting, I'm sorry, I can't see your comments. I'm trying out my Android tonight to see if I can see any comments. And at the moment, I actually cannot see any. And I can't see any on the, the thing I'm using. Um, so, so that's what we'll be using. We'll be using the Memories and More, our cardstock. We'll be using Night of Navy ink. Um, we're going to be using our Snail. And I'm going to use my Tombow. I'm going to see if I'm going to use the Twine. I'm not entirely sure yet because it's weird Wednesday for me today and then the other thing I wanted to use was my marker now <clears throat> I know a lot of people don't they they might not be familiar with markers or know what to do with markers but I have never used the markers before and I bought myself as a gift I bought myself the full set actually and I have to say I am not sorry that I invested in it because I do a lot of writing in my cards and I like the ink to match with what I have stamped so the thing to to remember with the, the markers is that it's exactly the same as the ink so what's in that ink pad is going to be exactly the same in my marker so if I'm using that ink pad, it's going to match my stamp so what you have here is you have the the thick nib and then you have the thin nib that you can actually write with. And um, these are refillable and a really good investment. So I will do a class on how to use these and different techniques. And um, I'll do that in the upcoming weeks. So that if you feel you want to buy yourself a beautiful gift or a Mother's Day gift, actually, there you go. You could ask for a, um, what do they call it? Those, what do you call it again? Oh my gosh, it's late at night. Um, oh my gosh, it's just slipped my mind. Those gift cards, that's it, the gift cards. They can put some money on a gift card for you and then you can invest in buying yourself a set of markers. They are absolutely brilliant. So I think that's about everything. Oh, and then we'll be using my favorite combination of um, punches I love using these two together it's quick and easy so I don't still have to pull out my um, although I love using my framelits sometimes I'm time poor and this goes very quick for me the only sad thing is that the starburst is not carrying over into our um, new catalog and um, if this one is still staying the two inch one is still staying thank goodness so, um, yeah, I would say if you want to invest in this combination, if this is still available, I'm not quite sure if this is still available, but check it out and see if you can grab it while it's still there. So we'll be using those two. All right. So that's pretty much everything we'll be using for the evening. So let me just put this aside. Now, there's one other thing I quickly want to show you before we really get into it. And I wanted to show you this new catalog. Yes, I have it in my hot little hands. And if you'd like um, a catalog, please let me know. Just message me and I'd be happy to send you one. Um, this goes live for our customers on the 2nd of June. 2nd, 2nd or 3rd of June. I mean, I mean, let me just check. It should tell me, I should know this. Ah, oh, 3rd of June. 
3rd of June it goes live. So if you'd like one, I'd be happy to send you one. And the other thing, if you want to get your hands on some of this, this stuff, um, because we're in the pre-order at the moment as a demonstrator, you can join as a demonstrator. And you can put, pick from the pre-order list. We get a pre-order list um, ahead of time. And then you can choose um, from that pre-order list um, to set yourself up with your new um, your starter kit, basically. That's what it is, your starter kit. So if you'd like to, ch to um, chat to me about that, that'll be great. I'd love to have you as part of my team. I've got a few great ladies that is in my team. And we have, um, I, I really enjoy my time with them. So, yeah, it's a pretty good time now to join. And when you do join, <clears throat> you get so much value for money um, when you do join. So, to sign up is $169, but the value of the kit is $235. So, you pay $169, but you can choose to the value of $235. And that is an awesome bargain. So, something to mull over. Another Mother's Day gift if you want. Just giving you some ideas. Anyway, let's get into this. Enough chatting. All right. So, <clears throat> I'll just show you the memories and more cards. These are actually really lovely to use, um, to make cards with. I'd have to say that there is, there is so much you can do with these. And um, you can use them for scrapbook pages as well um, to do these. And they all come double-sided. So, I'll just show you this one. This one is let's go somewhere and do something. And then there's a double-sided. So you could use that as a card front. This one is pretty too. Now the thing is, I saw this really cute thing that someone did now the other day. And I just score my card. I'll just, I'll just do fold my card. Now with these cards, you must just remember to line them up nicely. So, because sometimes... It can be a bit tricky. So just use your bone folder to get it nice and flat. So I, I think that sometimes people get stuck when they don't know what to do with the side of the card. Now remember you have the inside and you can stick it on the inside and you can write your greeting in there. And it just finishes off your card really nicely for you. So don't let this put you off. There are so many wonderful things you can do with these cards. And remember... You normally, you normally get two of each. So you could put that on the front and then you could put that on the inside. So that's the one. So we get small ones and we get the big ones. And there's some other cool things we also get in here. I'll just go through these first. So you have that side. And then it's normally a plain side and then a writing side, I think. And then these are just like little stickers that will come off that you can, you know, um, embellish your card with. I'll keep that there that one we've already seen so you get two of each so those two go together uh, the world's greatest guy look at that lovely paper it's beautiful now this is part of what the actual designer series paper looks like pardon me some anchors anchors away good one and then here again you've got space to write on or you could use that as a front for your card. I'll just put this aside quick. I've used some of these already. So I might not be showing you all of them. Here's some more stickers that you could use <clears throat> for the cards. Let me just take it a bit closer. Oops, not too close. So these you could also use to embellish your card with it's there's so much you can do i haven't played with it for such a long time there's another greeting oh this is beautiful isn't it what is life but a grand adventure yeah some of us are having that adventure at the moment with the COVID 19 hey all right so you basically get two of each you get the idea oh isn't that beautiful so again, you could write on the inside of the card and then you could use that as your front. Now, you can use this for um, as scrapbooking as your cards. 
Then you also have these cool, um, what do you call them, like stencils that you could also use as an overlay. So isn't that pretty? It's so, it's so cute. So you could use it as the white side or this like, um, what do you call this? It's like, it, it looks almost like a rope when you look at the texture of it. And you've got this beautiful, delicate one. So you can use, I think you can use it both sides if you want to. You've got this wavy color and it's like a blue color. Isn't that gorgeous? Same thing. Oh, this is, I, I've seen someone do something really cool with this one. So what they basically did was they had a picture and they framed it like that. So there's some really cool ideas. Now, I always say to customers when you're looking at at a stamp set or a suite and um, like demonstrators have already started using it, I always say go and type in the name of the suite or the stamp set into Google or into Pinterest and see the different cards that people have made because that will really give you ideas and you can see if, if, if it's something you'll use because sometimes we buy things and then we don't use them because we... We kind of think it's a challenge, you know, it, it, it's a challenge. But I always, for myself personally, I actually do do that. I, I will tell you, if I'm not sure, I'm sitting on the fence with a stamp set, I'll go and Google it or I will um, go and check it out on, on Pinterest as well to see what everybody's doing with it. And that um, will either persuade me to get it or I'll just leave it alone. So the other thing I want to do, just let you know, is just this little code here is the host code for May. So if you'd like to shop with me online, if you're ordering for 200, to, if you're ordering for less than 250, please don't use this code. If you decide to, to splurge and spend more than 250, um, then please don't use the code. Only use this if it's for less than 250. So we get the smaller cards. Now, the smaller cards, you know this pack I showed you, of the cards that you get. So you get the smaller cards, right? So these ones will fit perfectly on these little cards. Well, at least I think so. I haven't used them in such a while. Well, it is Wing It Wednesday. It's all coming back to me now. So, um... <laughs> sounded so weird so again do you see oh isn't that cute so you can put that on the inside of your card don't let this throw you off honestly th there's so many things you can do with these little cards and then oh isn't that beautiful any day with you is the best oh i love that do you see cute isn't it and it fits perfectly so if you bought yourself a pack of these cards which is the assorted memories and more remember they come with envelopes and there is 10 of each so that's 20 cards and if you just bought that and you bought yourself a pack of memories and more um, cards pack you have an endless array of cards that you can make with the stamp sets you have and the inks that you have so there's not a big outlay of any kind so we have a new catalog coming out on the 3rd of june and there is absolutely stunning things in there and if you if you feel that you are stretched which i, I can understand in the times that we are but you want to do something pretty just look at it from that perspective see if there's a nice memories and more pack which there is a few of which are absolutely gorgeous and a pack of that and you're good to go with the stash that you have we must learn to use what we do have and not just keep trying you know buying new stuff so that's my motto for myself actually to buy um the things that i that, like because i'm a demonstrator it's i i show people what i use i show them the new things so i do get new things but at the same time i'm trying to be really mindful to use what i do have um that's still current that's still in the that's going to carry over so yeah don't let it put you off it's 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 pretty cost effective anyway so let me show you these ones so you've got that side and that so any day so i'll put that so you've got the paper side there and you've got the word there and then you've got this pretty one you are made <laughs> you made my day and then you've got that on that end <clears throat> destination happiness again oh look how beautiful is that and then 
you know you could put that on the inside of the card now you also get two of these so eh? two each so um sorry just bear with me a sec i just want to go back here to see where i am at i apologize just stop like that anyway so again i'll show you this so you can see you know it's beautiful you could even put um some um you could put it layer it and then layer it like that on top of on top of that if you can see what i'm what i mean and then um you just put this little card this little guy on the inside and there you go you could even sponge the edges with a little bit of um knight of navy the ideas are endless all right so i don't want to keep you too long i don't want to go on too long so that's that one. Oh, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I love that. And again, there. Ahoy there. Beautiful. Um, memories. And then you've got that there. So you could stamp on that section there. You could. There's so much you could do with that. You could use the stickers. Got that one. Oh, look at this. Beautiful. Again, you can write on there. So pretty. I love them. They're so cute. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm sure we'll work. Oh, hello, handsome. I should make my husband a card with that one. So we got that. Our story. Oh, beautiful. And then you, you could do it as a portrait or you can do it as a landscape. So many good ideas that you can do with this. Um... Oh, I love that you made my day. You and me and the sea. Oh, beautiful. Adventure. This is so, such a guy thing. Beautiful. Any day with you is the best day, that's for sure. Love that. They're so nice. Sometimes I wonder why I even use this thing, eh? Soaring free. Oh, gorgeous gorgeous date place story i love that <laughs> oh that's gorgeous you me and the sea um our story again oh we haven't seen life is better when we are together oh for sure it's always better together beautiful anchor oh isn't that gorgeous oh Free as the ocean, and I do love the ocean. Lovely, beautiful. Saw that one already. Hello, handsome. Free as the sea. Yep, saw that one already. I think we've seen most of them. I don't think we've seen this one yet. Nice. I really like that color. Very lovely. I'm so drawn to blue. Blue is one of my favorite colors. Life is better together. Gosh, I'll be starting to sing soon. All right, so that's all of those cards. And I, I really love them. Memories and more card packs are definitely a great way to go when you're not, sh when, you, when you're starting out, that kind of thing. So now let's see. What shall we do? You know, I've never done a video where I wing it. Mm normally pretty organized but i thought why not it's wednesday the house is just gone quiet so i really like this one hey i'm liking that one um hmm, maybe i wish i could see the comments you know so that i could ask you There we go. Sorry, I'm just looking at something. So I know it's late. I really want to use this on the inside of my card. Um, mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay, those are the stickers. Oh, can't go away now. 
World's Greatest Guy. No. No. Hmm. I don't know. I'm thinking it's a toss up actually between this one. Hmm. Might have to trim it down. If I use it, did I use it? Okay, I'm liking that on there. Oh, okay, that looks good. So I'm going to use that on the inside. So I know what I'm going to do there. I'm really liking that. Yes, yes, yes. That looks good. I'm liking that. What did I do with it? Yes. Uh. All right, so we've got some of the stickers here and I'm wondering, do I use any of them? Mm, celebrate. So what I actually want to do is I want to stamp and because I've got this thing in my head so let me just go with it for a moment so what we'll do is I know I want to use that one for now so I'm going to stamp so this is from that stamp set a good man and the Greek the sentiment we're going to use is it's your day where did I put my ink pad? I have misplaced my ink pad. Oh, there we go. What is the time? I don't want to go too long. All right. So let's just do this. Beautiful. I love these punches. I'm just so glad this one is staying. And then I've already cut this one out, which is the Starburst one. I love this combination. And so that's good. That's good. So I'm going to put those on dimensionals because I love dimensionals. I'm that person. Yep. So I'm just going to put that on there some more. This is the only time I can really do any recording because my house is quiet. It's not the dark barking. The TV's going. All my children are having conversations. And everything travels to my front room because I don't have a door on it. So we'll just put that on there. There we go. Oh, doesn't that look pretty? Okay, so we've got that. I'm um, thinking. Oh, I'm going to use the baker's twine. I'm going to use the baker's twine. Let's just take this off. <laughs> I tell you, hope it comes out okay. <laughs> Golly me, Miss Molly. Okay. Let me just go and get my sellotape. tape. So I normally just put the um, sellotape tape around my card. So actually, what did I cut this? I probably put, cut it to small now. No. What were you thinking? Oops. So what I actually want to do is just do that. Yep, that's what I want to do. So let's just do that again. <clears throat> so basically what I do is I take a piece of um, sticky tape. Of where I want my card to start, just put that there, 
And so, I'll put it there because that's where I want it to start. And I'll do it straight, go across. I was just about to hum and then I remembered I'm doing a Facebook live. <laughs> oh, can you imagine if I did that? <laughs> oh, golly. I am not doing this alone. <laughs> oh, dear. Golly me. Okay, so... So that's normally what I do, and then I'll just use my um, Tombow glue to put that down on the Knight of Navy. I really hope you can see everything in the screen this time, because <laughs> the last time I wasn't so sure. There we go. Okay. Oopsie. actually in the screen so you can see what I'm doing I don't know how much I've put in here Oi. okay oh Well, well, well. Just make sure I've got it nice and centered. Don't you just hate that when that happens? Anyway, that should be all right. Got the lovely love there. I really like that, eh? Now, what I still want to do is I want to do a bow. I was thinking of doing it through there, but I don't think I want to do that, actually. So I'll just... Do this. <laughs> okay, there we go. I know that's such a big piece to cut off, but okay, I'm not going to worry too much about that now. There we are. I want to put that smack back. Uh, maybe not. Let's see what I do. I don't know what I'm going to do. Seems stressful winging it. My golly. All right. <coughs> if you watch this on the replay, thank you for taking the time to watch it. I see there's one person on at the moment. Thank you, whoever you were, who's gone now. All right. Um, this is your day. Mm. Okay, let's just put it over there. Oh, not too bad. And I'm thinking I'll actually stick that there. Yep, I think I shall. If I can find my glue dots, I certainly hope so. You just roll your glue dot with your bows. You just roll the glue dot and you stick it on the back. And I'm actually just going to stick it over here. Just like so. Not too bad, actually. I like that. Oops, make it a bit smaller. Does everybody 
Is everybody good at making bows? I am not. I just didn't do that well, did I? Oops, let me just do it again quickly. Duh. Golly, again, I wanted to sing. <laughs> okay. Hello, whoever you are. Thank you for stopping by to watch. I can't see any comments at the moment, but I am most grateful for you stopping by. This is me struggling to make a bow at quarter past ten on a Wednesday night, winging it. My first winging, my first wing Wednesday. I've never winged anything as far as my card making goes live anyway. But here I am doing it. Um, you deserve to get this card for watching this. I just want to lift this up a tad and just stick it there. Okay. I tell you, I love these snips. They are certainly the best snips I've ever used. Okay, I like that. I'm happy with that. I'm not going to fiddle with it anymore because then it's just going to end up being a colossal. I'm trying to think of what word to use after colossal. <laughs> My brain has gone to sleep, I tell you what. Okay, and let's just put this on here. Okay, I'm actually liking how that came out, eh? Not too shabby. Lovely. Very nice. It's your day. Mm, you don't look too bad. All right, now where is the card I wanted to use on the inside? I know the card I wanted to use on ah there we go so this is the card I wanted to use on the inside remember it's two-sided so that's what it looks on the other side and this is what I want to put in there isn't that pretty I like it yes all right and we are nearly done oh. I love using this glue. Once you get practice at first, oh my gosh, it was a mess when I used this. But now, you know, oops, <laughs> check. Okay, that's the right way to go. There we are. Okay, let's see. The Tombow glue gives you time to adjust it. So, all right. Pretty. Oh, I love that. Now, if you wanted to, if you wanted to, you could use these little birds that is in the Come Sail Away stamp set. And you could just. Oopsie. I knew that was going to happen because it happened the last time. I just hate it when that happens. So let me just take out our little chamois. It's a good thing it didn't fall on the card, hey? This chamois is, um, it's, it looks like a mess, but it's actually pretty good. It actually cleans your stamp very well. Um, golly, I'm really sorry about that. I didn't realize it would have come off. But it did happen to me earlier on when I was doing something else. But I am just grateful it didn't fall, come off on my card. So what you could do is... Let me just put this in the camera there. You take your little birds and you just stamp them. And there you go. Isn't that pretty? Pretty neat. I like that. So, now that is our card. I think it came out really lovely. What do you think? I think it's not too bad. We could add some birds over there, but I don't want to take the risk of ruining it. <coughs> So I think I'll leave it just like that. Sometimes less is more. So now we'll do our envelope. We never leave our envelopes naked. So all I'm going to do is use that same bird stamp and just stamp it over here. And stamp it off. Stamp it there. That's all. And then on the back. Stamp them 
flying away. And I'll put the top. There we go. Easy done. And oops, see, I missed on the I did a bit of blue ink there, so I'll redo the envelope. But that is our card. Don't you think it's beautiful? So that's our beautiful card this evening. I like how it came out. Not too shabby at all. So I hope you enjoyed that wing it one. <laughs> I just made one to this evening because I want um I'll probably pop on again tomorrow night and um make a female card a actually it's not going to be a female card it's going to be a card of encouragement actually because that's that's the um challenge i have um so i'm making a card of encouragement um i'm going to be making two one that i'll show you and one that i'm doing as a challenge with my team and so thank you so much for watching. Thank you for the two people still there that I can see. I can't see your comments, but thank you so much for watching. Thank you for stopping by. And if you're watching the replay, please leave me a comment. I actually want to, um, I want to actually go through my comments and then I'm going to pick a name and um, hopefully I can message you to let you know I've got a little gift for you and then I can send it to you because you certainly deserve something for staying up this late and watching me. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. And have a lovely evening. I hope you rest well. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.